sort of reaction do you think you're going to get from the Chelsea fans tomorrow? I think that the, if you analyse carefully what I said, what I was trying to explain is that we have 11 games to play. That means uh, 33 points. So I think that if we stick together behind the team, it will be easy for us to get points. If you remember some games, I think that the, the fans are really, really important for the team. So if you remember some games and here, and we were talking about before about Napoli, the atmosphere against Napoli, or this year against Arsenal, it's a big difference when you have everybody behind the team pushing and pushing. That was uh, my idea, so I think that it's uh, clear, the message is clear. Uh, you can see, you can read the newspapers and they will say you have this, that. I didn't have any problem uh, with the board. I didn't have any problem with Michael Emenalo. I didn't have any problem with uh, Roman Abramovich. I don't have any problem with players. So what I want to do is the best for the team, the best for the club. I have been for 26 years training, coaching, and uh, always, always uh, I have had principles, or principles, uh, principles you say in English, respect and education is the way that I have achieved what I achieve. So we have 11 games to play. If we stick together, it will be easier and we can get more points. And I would like to see a fantastic atmosphere supporting the team and I will be really pleased with that. Have you spoken to, to Roman since uh, when first press? That is my business. Have you had any indication from the Chelsea board as to their reaction when you said that being an interim manager is, is damaging? I you was... No, because it was not the case. I could read that the, I had problem with Emenalo, with the board. It's not true. Yesterday I was uh, with Ron and today I was talking with Ron again and yesterday he was telling me, oh, you know, it's very cold, you are training with shorts. So he was joking and we were talking and it was a normal conversation and talking about football. So again, I will say that uh, I have some experience in doing things uh, normal with respect and with education and I still I keep my passion, my ambition. And if I came to this club, it's because it's a top side and we can win trophies. Still, we can win two, two trophies. So and I'm really pleased. Being interim manager, though, does it impact at all on the authority you have with your players? In my head, uh, I am the manager. I have to manage the team. So it doesn't matter the title. Title is if you win the Champions League. That is a big title. But uh, the other way is just uh, concentrate on my job. And it's fine. It's okay.